Hello there, Neil Down here. I have with me somebody who has come over from the United States to be with people at the European Puppet Ministry Festivals at Derby and Reading. So let me introduce to you, please, Mr. Dave Prevett. Thank you very much, uh, Reverend. I'm glad to be here. Well, uh, Dave, the first question I want to ask you, really, I suppose, is perhaps the ultimate question. What tip would you give any puppeteer about their puppetry? I guess the biggest tip I can give to any puppeteer about their puppetry would be uh, to remember that old Bee Gees song. Which, which old Bee Gees song? The one that goes, You have to stay alive. Keep your puppet alive. You, you, there's no time on the stage when you have your puppet in position that can allow that puppet to, to not have complete life. Bringing your puppet to life is the most important thing you can do. Do you know, that's an extraordinary thing for you to say. Because not only is it true, I'm sure, but isn't it also true of us that the most important thing for you and I is to really be alive. Absolutely, alive in Christ, new life. That's right. And uh, it's, you see, it's a great thing, isn't it? Actually talking with another Christian puppeteer because we can talk the same language and you can too once you get to know Jesus. Uh, Dave, how can people get to know Jesus? How can they get to know Jesus? By reading their Bible, by talking to him, you can just ask him anytime, any place where you are. But the way to get to know Jesus is to get to know him through his word, go and visit his people, be around them, you will learn, and most of all, just ask him to come into your heart. Dave, I hope you have a, I hope you've had a great time at Derby, and I hope uh, you've had a great time at Reading too. And thank you so much for coming to join us today. Thank you, Reverend. I am very glad I got a chance to have this chat with you. Well, and remember, if you want to keep alive, and not just your puppet, then the person to get to know is Jesus. Bye! Yes, we will be